Hi there, welcome to WP Matt. Here in this video, you are going to be learning about Yelp review widget of LMS Kit plugin. Before talking about the Yelp widget, go to LMS Kit, Elements, then scroll down and make sure the Yelp widget is activated. After that, click Save Changes, then scroll up, then go to User Data, and there you'll find Yelp settings. If you open it, there you'll find Yelp page. In this box, you have to put the username of your page. After that, click Save Changes, then open any page with Elementor Page Builder and search Yelp. Drag and drop the widget on your page. After that, you'll find the reviews of your page into your website. Now let's see some of the controls of the Yelp widget. In the left side, the first setting you have, which is the layout style. Right now, it's with reviews, but you can select slideshow. After that, you have review type, which is both. From here, you can select only positive review. And there you have the card type. From here, you can select the box type or the bubble card. After that, if you go to the contents tab, there you'll find the thumbnail badge, which is by default turned off, but you can enable it. Then you have the control to show and hide the top right logo. I want to hide it. After that, you have the slideshow setting. There you'll find the spacing left right. If you increase it, there you'll see the slides are taking space after and before it. After that, slide to show option. Right now it's three, but I want to show two. Then you have slide to scroll. I want to scroll one. After that, you have speed. You can also manage the autoplay. Then you have the show arrow. If you enable it, you'll find two arrow in the left side and right side. After that, you have show dot, and then you have pause and hover option. If you want to control the typography and the color on that time, you have to go to style tab, and there you'll find all the settings to control the individual item. As an example, if you want to work with the background color, go to widget and in here you can select the background color you want. After that, you have the padding and then if you go to the review card, they will find all the control to work with the card. Right now, it's 24 pixel padding from all sides, but I want to use 50 pixel. There you can also work with the background color and the box shadow. Let's use the background color a little bit red. Now if you go to review or thumbnail, there you can work with the thumbnail size and the margin right. If you increase the thumbnail size, they will find the size of the image will increase. After that, review your name setting, review date, and the review stars. If you go to review stars, there you can work with the text color of the review. After that, review feedback, there you can work with the text color, text shadow, and the typography. Now if you open the typography, there you can work with the font family, font size, font width, etc. Let's use the font family Open Sans. And the font size I want to use is 24 pixel. After that, let's use the line height a bit and let's keep the other settings as it is. Now, if you go to the post it on, there you can work with Yelp icon and the icon size. So, this is all about the Yelp preview widget of the Elements Kit plugin. Thank you for watching this video.